Here we go, you guys. So, I think in this part, we basically... What, what do I have to do, actually? Oh, yeah, we're supposed to find, like, the little, like, emblems or whatever fits in that indentation. I accidentally dropped my mic. For the first time, I'm actually not using my, uh... My, uh, headset. Just because I want to kind of, like... Oh, my God. These guys, these guys trying to sneak up on me. So this is where like the graveyard part comes in. Remember the three uh, symbols from the last episode? This is what it's for. So three family insignials of the dead ringers. It looks like the dial only turns clockwise in either three or four increments. So I don't know if I'm supposed to like turn them off or turn them on. But basically, what I have to do is lock off the other one. So I'm going to do four. Okay, I think I messed up. I think I'm supposed to choose the correct ones. I'm going to do four again. No. Let me choose the ones that I do know. So let's do three. All right, let's do four. Now let's do... I believe it should be four, then four. And do four again. And now we do three. Were those the right symbols or did I mess up? Hmm. I think I'm supposed to use that little M looking one. There you go. So it did have the wrong symbol. The green cat's eye. Hey, hey, look at that. And I think there's also one of these. Uh, what is it? Blue medallions up here. Yep. There it is. All right, my bad, you guys. I kind of like forgot which were the right symbols. Anyways, let us be in our way. We've wasted enough time as is. <laughs> I was stuck there for like three minutes or so. I am not yeah, I don't know. There we go. Pick this up. Turn the top over. Turn the bows. Pick this up. Put the medallion. I don't know if there's anyone in here. I believe this is where they introduced the little stupid snakes. Maybe. Oh, so they do introduce some in this game. Right. Closure of the church. Regarding the two fugitives, the apprehension of Lewis is our top priority. The American agent, a distant second. What Lewis stole from us is far more important than the girl. Unless we get it back, the girl will become useless to us. We must get it back to execute our plan to the end. If it gets in the wrong hands, the world would become a totally different place than the Lord Sattler has envisioned. At all costs, we mustn't let that happen. Nevertheless, we're not letting go of the girl. To ensure that the agent does not get to her, I have locked the church door where the girl is being held. Anyone who needs access to the church must first get approval by Lord Sattler. There's a key beyond the lake, but it should be safe now that the Del Lago has been awakened by her lord. No one will get across the lake alive. Plus, our same blood courses through the agent's veins. It'll just be a matter of time before he joins us. Once he does, there will be nobody else left that will come looking for the girl. Interesting. Anything you gotta say about that, Leon? Take the chicken egg. Okay, so here's here's a little fun one. You won't see it unless you had Kaleda are heading back. But damn it. There you go. The last one is actually right here. As soon as you jump over, you're supposed to turn around. And you'll spot it right out. Or maybe when you're like on your way back from over here. Alright. Let's keep going. This guy, shut up, man. 
They didn't even drop anything. Worthless. So yeah, the girl they're talking about is obviously the president's daughter. Her name's Ashley, and I'll be honest with you, she's super annoying. Hate that girl, man. It's, that's like the worst part of the game. Being on your own is the best part. <laughs> Once you uh, rescue that girl, it's, it sucks. Okay, so this one's, this one's pretty cool. Shoot. Oh my god. Look at that. Beautiful. Damn it, I gotta stop pressing the wrong one. If you shoot one, they will all fly out. So the thing you have to do in this one is actually uh, throw a grenade. And get them all in one go. Why? Because look, look at all that. <laughs> Aha, that was beautiful. Is there anything else in here that's of uh, importance? Yes, there is. So this is that one area I was talking about earlier where you face an enemy, which holds like that's the problem for the future. But just know that in this area, when I come back, the little wolf dog that we saved in the beginning will come to aid us. I don't think it'll matter, but the thought is what counts, right? <laughs> it matters if you're if this is like your first playthrough. And you clearly don't have any good weapons, or they're not like they're not even um. Upgrade it. Alright. Anyways, we're gonna keep pushing forward. Wow, how the hell did I miss? That is sad, you guys. That is so sad. Can I go this way? Hold on. Hold on, you guys. Oh, I could. There's a little, like... Light I could destroy. Has no purpose, but you could destroy it. <laughs> okay. So this area is where we eventually come back. But I think right now it doesn't matter. So what I am going to do is get whatever items are in here. And then... Let's see, anything else? Anything else? Oh yeah, there's a barrel here. Damn it. From here, we're going to go... We're not going to save. There's no need to save. But we are gonna talk to the merchant. I'm gonna try to Got sell. A selection of good things on sale, stranger. Ah, shoot! Like I promised, go claim your specialized gun in the buy screen. But don't worry about money. This one's on the house. So basically, what are you buying? Whenever you get all the medallions, this is what you get. The Punisher gives you this pistol for free. But I don't think we need it. Or I could just buy it like eventually for twenty thousand. But I mean, I'll buy it and then I guess I'll sell it or something. <laughs> what are you selling? Is that all? <laughs> Is that all? Look at all this crap. Is that all? Is that all? Thank you. This is so cool because you're we're making money off something he gave us for free. It's not the full twenty thousand, but still, not even we're like getting over half. Not bad at all, you guys. Not bad at all. That's how you do business. I am. I'm sure you will. Thank work. you. Rid of the chicken. Is that all? <laughs> Thank you. Tell Is that all? <laughs> Thank you. Green herb. I guess I'll keep that. A spinal. Is that all? <laughs> Thank you. Cool. All right. So now that we have that under way, let's head back up. I think the cat's eye is what I actually need for the treasures, if I'm not mistaken. Let's see, this is the one that goes either with uh, this or the mask. Okay, so I'm missing one more. It's the cat's eye. Once I have the third one, which is probably the blue one, I think we'll be set. Now, I don't know if I might have missed it, to be honest. I might have. <laughs> but if not, we'll probably get it somewhere ahead. So now we're off to the other door again. I just needed to come here to sell the stuff. That way I'm not like too full on items. Hopefully there's no one in here because I just ran in there. They didn't check behind me. Of course it's in the clear. We should be good to go. Uh, oh crap. I think this is one, another one of those where like I have to like run away from like a boulder or something. Yep. I 
hate these tapping ones. I mean, I don't mind them. It's not that bad at all. But it's just like the last part that scares me, you know? There. The Square X. I think it's Square X and L1 or R1 or L2 and R2. It's always one of those two. But... You never know when I might mess it up and then that's how I end up dying. Alright, perfect. There's like so many traps here to watch out. I'm gonna kill these guys from afar. I guess I might as well get rid of those. Hold on. See, he dropped something. Something of value. I'm trying to remember what is over here actually. There might be a lot of stuff for me to pick up. You just have to be careful with like the the trip wires or whatever you call those. Close one. That was a close one. I feel like there's someone coming. I just don't want them to sneak up on me because of this. I'm not trying to do like a perfect run, like no hits, but you know, like, might as well if I can. And if they hit me, oh well. It is what it is. Like, I'm just playing this game because I love playing it. And because, like I said, I just want to I just want to have it on the YouTube channel. This is like a classic. You can't go wrong with it. The most important part of playing games is being able to enjoy them. And after a while, it does kind of get stressful with certain games. Just depends. Sometimes you're just not in the mood. See, that's the thing about me. Like, I think the way I would play games, for the most part, is like I would play a bit of one, get bored, put another game, get bored, go back to the other game, and I would always be constantly swapping back and forth. But now, because of this. Oh wow, where'd he come from? Oh, they're dropping. Oh, they come from here. I forgot about that. I come down here. I completely forgot they come from behind. Here I was just looking forward. Huh. Very interesting. One of those things you forget over time. But yeah, now I've actually uh, decided to dedicate and pass most of the games I play. You know, some of them are a little hard. <laughs> I'm just like, damn, like, I'm kind of tired. I don't want to play no more. Or I just get caught up with other stuff. Or, you know, I just like taking a break. <laughs> like, you don't know how much work you have to put behind, like, all this stuff to actually do it yourself. No, the gameplay, the gameplay itself is like probably the easiest part of it all. You know, like you get to enjoy it, you play, you do as you want. And I don't know why I just remembered, but I'm so excited for like the, the new, uh, I want to say remastered, but I don't even think it's going to be remastered. But that Dead Space that they announced not too long ago from EA, I'm excited for that. Like, I feel like I haven't played a game like that in such a long time. And I'm actually going to be scared to play like when it comes out. Because I heard they're making some like changes to it. It's not gonna be like a, an exact like remaster. It's gonna actually be overhauled with added uh, features to it. So I'm a little excited about that. I want to check it out. See how it is. Like I don't know if they could uh, attack me while they're in the water. Like I think this is the first time I noticed them. Swimming like that. But I don't want to take the chance. <laughs> So yeah, anyways, like, horror games, I used to love playing these games a lot. Like, I don't know why. There was something wrong with me, man. Now I'm just like, oh, I don't want to play them. Like, you know, it actually makes me nervous. I think it's just the fact that there's, like, a crowd now that I imagine, like, seeing my every little move. And they're going to be like, dude, such a wuss. And I'm like, oh, I mean, I wasn't a wuss, but <laughs> I'm just a little more nervous because, you know, <laughs> now there's someone behind me, like, watching over my shoulder. Ah, oh, 
Ah, you little s You. Oh, wow. I popped the egg. Well, there you go, you guys. Our first hit by a snake. Of all creatures, of all things, of all humans over here, a snake. So yeah, as much as I love horror games, like I hate them too. Did I see a... Almost got away. Actually, might as well use it. Oh, it's a golden one. Oh man. It just has more value. Oh well. Comes to show, it give Leon the best when it comes to it. <laughs> Honestly, money is not even an issue anymore. Uh, anything around here? I feel like there is something I need to like look at. I just don't know where it might be. Was it a nest? Oh, there you go. There's the second body. Shit. Vámonos. Okay. Andale. You know, I can't believe they took this long to dispose of it, to be honest. Like, the other body has been burning for, like, hours at this point. Like, why did it take them so long to get here? Holy crap, you guys. Del Lago. All right. All right. Now that's a fish that actually could kill me. And you'll see why. You know, I swear there was something over here. Like, there's no way I, I came up here, like, and leave empty handed. Unless it was on the bottom. That could also be the thing. I don't, I don't see anything. Maybe I am tripping. I'm going here. Okay. Just in case it might have been like a freaking snake or something. Man, hold on. Why is there a star? See, I did miss something. I wasn't tripping. It's all things in my map, though. Oh man. It's here. Oh, we are set. Alrighty, here we go. Uh, I don't think there's anything else over here. From the looks of it. So, what I am gonna do is pick up this herb. Damn it again. Here we go. Oh, I'm a little too off. Wasn't close enough. It's fine. It happens. My depth perception isn't the best sometimes. I missed something over here. I wonder how much I've missed, actually. Oh, I haven't been there. Oh, I missed something over here. Oh, I haven't been there. Look at the map, you guys. That's the whole map from where we started. This is, I believe, the bridge. And then this is a little house we went and it goes on. It's not too bad. So I'm probably going to go back just to get that. I can't believe I forgot that. I didn't even know I had a map about it. I don't know if the stranger sells it to you. So that way when you like do your next miracle run or something, <laughs> you have access to it. Uh, I don't know if I'm allowed to return, to be honest. But let's, let's go check it out. I think I should be fine. Okay. So where the hell did I miss? Was it a chest? Was it something hanging from a nest, like a tree, like a tree nesting? -y? Or what could it have been? I honestly don't know. Was it on top? Was it on the bottom? I think it was on the bottom. From the looks of it, it was pointing around here. I think it might have been over here. Uh, maybe not. Okay, what could it have been? I feel like, let me check this tree. Oh, there you go. Ah, oh, crap. Of course it would be down there. It's up there, but technically down there. Mm. 
You got the antique pipe. Oh, okay, cool. These valuables, honestly, like, I don't even need them. I just like clearing them, because why not? Now that we're done with all of that, all right, let us head on over back to that lake area and then get what needs to be done, done, you know? Uh, I think this is kind of like gonna be the first boss fight actually, but it, it's a little weird because I can't really do anything about it. It's more like you have to go with like the flow of like the mechanics for it. So it makes it a little harder because like I won't be using any of my weapons. But it's okay. I want to save, but I mean, I just want to have faith that I'll get this done in one try. Oh my god. Get on, Leon. Alright, here we go, you guys. inconvenience of that <laughs> I think this is the first game where they introduced the uh, like these kind of BOWs and this is where like they also show you that you have to freaking swim fast luckily for me I know how to button mash so that's pretty good <laughs> it saves me but I don't I think it keeps getting harder and harder this time Disorienting. Oh, I thought I got him. Here we go again. Jesus. Like, the camera is so disorienting, that's a problem. Aw, oh, come on, I swear I got him. They make you seem like it's gonna eat you. I think the problem is, I'm not moving. I'm supposed to like also move. There you go, that's the problem. I wasn't moving around. I was just like floating there and I needed to like move around as well. There you go. There we go. I was like a little nervous because I wasn't sure I was going to get him. What I should do is use one of these. I mean, Steven increases my health. I doubt it, but it's worth finding out. No, that's it. What's done is done. Oh, come on. Just because I paused, I did that to myself. So as long as you know how to button match, I think you'll be just fine. <laughs> you could mess up as many times as possible. You'll be fine. On Leon, grab onto that hook, throw it. Ah, oh, come on. Aren't I lucky? <laughs> I could quite have matched that fast. A lot of people would have like probably just died already. I am gonna die though if I don't like kill myself up. This is so disorienting. I don't think I ever struggled this much the first time, to be honest. I don't know why I'm struggling now. Take that. Take 
Jabs, come on, Leon. Hey. Take that. Take that. Honestly, I don't know if this is how you're supposed to kill it. From from what I recall, you're supposed to throw it in the mouth. So I don't know if this works as well. Like I said, if I could just use my weapons, it would have died so much faster. Oh, there you go. Go again. One last one, you guys. One last one. Let's get this in the way. Hey. Well, that was a horrible display of skills when it came down to like dealing with Del Lago. But hey, you know what? It's been a while. At least I didn't die. I didn't save either. <laughs> so like I could have gone really bad. Anyways, you guys, I am going to leave it at that. Thank you for watching. Please leave a like if you enjoyed this. Subscribe if you haven't for even more game content. And as always, I'll catch you guys on the next episode.